Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay with Gardner Supply Company and today we're talking about grow lights and starting your seeds. To set your grow lights up for successful seedlings, you're going to want to keep in mind three things. The type of bulb, the position of your grow light, and the photo period. We'll take a deeper dive into lighting concepts and terminology in another video, but for seedlings, just keep it simple. You want to just look for something that's labeled full spectrum. Color temperature is measured on a spectrum from warm to cool. Uh, it's measured in the units of Kelvin. Uh, and a full spectrum bulb is going to be between 5,000 and 6,500 Kelvin. It's going to mimic natural sunlight and kind of have a bright, clean white hue to it. For sturdy seedlings, you want to make sure your plants are positioned directly under the grow light. Light starts to dissipate as soon as it leaves the bulb, so you really want to make sure your plants are tucked up under there. Many of our grow light systems actually have adjustable lights, so you can lower the bulb and raise it as your seedlings grow. You can keep the bulbs close to the tops of your seedlings, about six inches from the top, unless you're using a high intensity LED bulb, in which case you can raise the bulbs up a little bit more, about a foot. If you're seeing really pale, thin, leggy seedlings, you're making your plants work way too hard, you need to bring the bulb down closer to the top of the seedling or pick your plants up and move them up a little bit so they're closer to the bulb. Your seedlings need tons of bright light for healthy growth. You'll want to aim for about 14 to 16 hours of bright, consistent light per day. But plants also do benefit from a dark period as part of their growth cycle, so you don't want to leave your grow lights on 24 hours a day. Uh, if you're like me, you'll probably be checking on your seedlings 100 times a day. Uh, but in case you forget, uh, I recommend connecting your grow light to a programmable timer. That way you can be sure that your light will turn on and off at the correct time. Please put any questions you have in the comments section below and check out gardeners.com. Happy growing!